check out alibaba.com oh yeah yeah this showed I up saw on the this. subreddit this week <laughs> dare me to order are you, one. i was gonna say are you guys gonna get one unfortunately i would have to order 500 pieces oh my goodness i love that the number of people that don't understand how our screwdriver works yeah this isn't the same drives one. me absolutely crazy this isn't like a third shift situation guys there is no chinese factory to run a third shift yeah. how the fuck many times do i have to say this before people will somehow process that the LTT screwdriver is not some made in China rebadge. It just f***ing isn't. <laughs> and no amount of <laughs> whatever it is that you're doing over there is going to change the actual reality that it just isn't. We collaborated with Megapro licensed their bit storage, licensed their ratchet, heavily modified their ratchet design. At this point, with the stubby screwdriver, we have actually modified their bit storage enough that we are no longer dependent on the patent for it. Um, the ratchets are produced in China. The shafts are produced in China. The plastics are all produced in Pitt Meadows, British Columbia. The assembly is done here in the greater Vancouver area, there is no third shift. Just sit the f down. <laughs> it's incredible. Uh, anyway, uh, this was still pretty funny because, um, yeah, a sample is apparently about the cost of these guys buying one of our screwdrivers. So if you order a sample, what's very likely is they will simply buy one of our screwdrivers and send oh. it to you. They've ripped the photos directly off of our site. Oh, nice. Other than it seems like attempting maybe or maybe not. To like blur it out a little bit. blur our logo a little bit. They've even included our like crusty rusted bits that we use to demonstrate that you can install standard size bits in it. Um, I would I would totally order one to see if it's, if it's uh, even a, a somewhat close copy but the issue is that they want you to order 500 pieces and I, there's no way I'm going to order a sample to see what they can make because they're just going to send me one of my screwdrivers. If I wanted one of my screwdrivers, I would just walk into the warehouse and grab one. Yeah. <clears throat> um, is the listing a scam though? Yeah, the listing is in all likelihood a scam. So there's a lot of, so there's a lot of different takes on this. You know, one of the takes is, see, I told you, it's just, it was a matter of time. There's a lot of like, oh, LTT, better watch out for this. It's the third shift. And then there's a lot of people that actually understand what's going on here. And that is that this manufacturer is fraudulently claiming that they make this screwdriver. It is possible that you will get something in the mail that it resembles our screwdriver, but I promise you it will not be ours. Yeah. Um, and the attention to detail that it would take to get it to be ours would not be put in by this manufacturer. There is absolutely no way, because even though it's a seemingly relatively simple mechanical device, the devil's in the details. It's easy for them to make one. Actually, it would be relatively easy for them to make one screwdriver that pretty much is pretty similar to the LTT screwdriver, to mass produce it, with the kind of quality that we do would be really difficult. And that's what took so long. Um, yeah. So, yeah. so that's the thing. Yeah. Is that trickle down economics? Thanks Twitch chat. I can always <laughs> count on you. <laughs>